When you have troubles, don't cry. You know I can't sing. George Nux, what's your ass gone and do now? Nux! If you wanna know what the hell happened to George Nux, make sure you watch this video. Gala, you're pretty light, light, thin city. Gala, want you back it up for Bob One drop. Tell me a slime moving like a victim. Family, back it up for Bob Z. Gala, one drop. Gala, drop, drop. Hey! Drop down your body, gala, drop, drop. For Bob Z. Drop down your body, gala, drop, drop. Yes! Drop down your body, gala, drop, drop. For Bob Z. Drop down your body, gala, drop, drop. Take it down to the ground, gala, drop, drop. drop. What's up everybody, your girl Babsy here, Caribbean Music Review, I know, I know, we back, we back up in this with my Nitro NRG, y'all, understand what's going on? Anyhow, before I get into the video, make sure you are following me on Instagram, my name there is Strictly Babsy, as well as on Twitter, all my social media outlets, except for Facebook, my name is Babsy at large. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel right here, this is my Caribbean Rundown Music Review Rants channel, so stay about here, so you understand what's going on, you understand? And for those of you who want to follow me and make sure that you don't miss nothing from my lives and this and that, download my app. It's called Babsy Beyond Blogging in the Google Play and in the iTunes Store. Don't message me if you have an 8520 Blackberry because you can't download it. And before I get into the video, don't forget Barbados on the Water is May 26th to May 28th, Harbor Front, Toronto. It is going to be a very big, big weekend. We have Edwin Yearwood, Red Plastic Bag, Lil Rick, Peter Ram, Bubba, um, Arturo Tappen, the saxophone player, DJ Puffy, the Red Bull DJ champion of the world. So it's going to be very, very big. A lot of the events are free. Make sure you check out the website. I'm going to list it below and download the Visit Barbados.org app in the Google Play and the iTunes Store. And if you've got a Blackberry 8520, don't message me. So George Nooks was arrested the other day. George Nooks, what's your ass doing? Um, yeah, for having cocaine in his possession in his 2016 Mercedes-Benz SUV. Yeah. So um, it's been a lot of conversation going back and forth because if you don't know who George Nooks is, he is a gospel reggae singer. So a lot of people feel disappointed because of um, the type of music that he sings, etc. Now this is what I'm going to say and I'm going to just make this fast. A, nobody knows if George Nooks is on cocaine or if he's not on cocaine cocaine they found cocaine in his car that doesn't automatically make him a crackhead cocaine head okay just get that understood next thing because he sings gospel music does not mean he's a Christian it means he sings gospel music he may not even believe in God he sings gospel music so just understand that a lot of you like to put people in categories based on what they do Pastors may not believe in God, deacons may not believe in God, but they believe in the money offering that your ass going to bring in the church and give them. So just be very mindful going forward. He may not even be religious. He might be part of ISIS. All I'm saying is don't look at the type of music these people sing and basically align that with the type of lifestyle that they should be living. He may very well not even believe in God. Lastly, I don't think this is going to be the end of his career. I mean, George Nooks has been around forever. You know, I had a discussion with someone this morning who didn't even know George Nooks is Prince Muhammad. One time, data one time, in um, Someone Loves You Honey. But then again, that's why I'm here to educate the masses. Yes, Prince Muhammad is George Nooks. If you want to go check those songs out, Someone Loves You Honey, the man voice in that song, that's George Nooks before he turned into George Nooks. You understand? Next topic, DJ Rolex in Jamaica beaten for playing a massacre song. Now, DJ Rolex is citing that he was beaten by Idonius Camp for playing a massacre song. I feel like a lot of times this is reckless conversation. Um, Rolex needs to identify who beat him and find out why he was beaten before he makes assumptions and goes to the media and says that it's Idonia and his people that beat him on purpose. Idonia may not have even known that he was getting beat up and this is another issue that we have in Caribbean media. We allow too much reckless comments that are not investigated to be put forth as stories. Um, yeah, you were beaten up but you don't know why and until you know why, you need not call people like Idonia's name. If it was Idonia's manager, say it was Idonia's manager. They beat you up when this song was playing, 
then say that. But don't be like, Idonius can't beat me for playing a massacre. That kind of shit aggravates me because you really don't know why your ass got beat up. So investigate that a little bit more before you come out here talking about what people have done to you when they might not have even known what the hell happened to your ass. You understand? And good news for Beanie Man. Beanie Man's Romy was sampled in Fate and Furious, formerly known as Fast and Furious, which probably means I'm cha-ching-ching -ching for Beanie Man. Beanie, you know me, you was friends of Wada Duke Card or what? Anyhow, I'm just joking. Um, congrats to Beanie Man on that. As I said, like, this is where you want your music to go, where your payday is going to be extremely big, and you won't be like, cha-ching-ching. And in the Soka world, a whole bunch of new songs being released. A lot of Trinidadian artists releasing some stuff too, sounding pretty good. As you know, in May, there's going to be a lot of carnivals coming up. Cayman just had theirs. Um, but right now, over the next couple of weeks, you're going to have Atlanta, which is May 27th. They're going to be having their carnival. Houston is going to be having their carnival on the same day, which is May 27th, as well as Orlando, Florida, as well as San Francisco, California. So you have four carnivals on the same weekend from May 27th as you know we going towards pace time now for Soka a lot of songs are coming out I have my list of songs put together please bear with me as you know I've been traveling I've been getting engaged and I've been doing a whole bunch of other shit with my damn life so take it easy on me you understand so there you have it. Quick, quick, quick Caribbean music rundown this week. You know, I'm going to be back later in the week with a lot more bigger stories following up on George Nooks. George Nooks, what's your ass out here doing? Uh, yeah. And um, hopefully we'll have some more positive news to spread about what's going on in the industry, etc. Big ups to Beanie Man on that. You know Beanie Man and my peoples. I love him. So make sure you are subscribed to this channel here because this is my rants and review channel. And don't forget to follow me on all my other social media outlets as well as subscribe to my reality channel because we getting that back out in Jiggy. Mwah. Love you guys. See you soon. Oh Lord my God When I meet awesome wonder Consider all Thy works, thy hand doth make. I see the stars, I hear the mighty thunder. Thy power throughout the universe displays. Then sings my soul.